Despite pressure from Western countries, India has remained steadfast in its partnership with Russia, refusing to condemn the war in Ukraine and not joining Western sanctions against Moscow. However, as Anjana Pastricha reports from New Delhi, this has not affected its growing ties with the United States. As the Ukraine conflict raged, India refused to pick sides between its Western partners and Russia. On a visit to Moscow last month, India's foreign minister said New Delhi will bolster economic ties with its Cold War ally. For us, Russia has been a steady and time-tested partner. And as I said, uh, any, any objective evaluation of our relationship over many decades would confirm that it has actually served both our countries uh, very, very well. New Delhi has not joined Western sanctions and has also increased its purchases of discounted Russian crude oil, coal and fertilizers. It has abstained from United Nations resolutions condemning Moscow over its aggression. Analysts say with India's military heavily dependent on tanks, fighter jets and other equipment of Russian origin, it could not afford to isolate Moscow. If your soldiers are facing the Chinese soldiers, you, you can't really uh, take on the one country that is supplying you weapons. So I think in some ways that, that defense relationship that India shares with Russia uh, made India choose a more pragmatic sort of an engagement with Russia. But the escalation in the Ukraine conflict, such as strikes by Russia on Ukraine's energy infrastructure, is causing concern in New Delhi. In September, Prime Minister Narendra Modi told Russian President Vladimir Putin on the sidelines of a regional summit that this is not an era of war. Significantly, an annual summit held regularly between the Russian and Indian leaders has not been scheduled this year. So there has been a, there has been a, some um, uh, you know, a negative response to what Russia is doing. But I think public condemnation of Russia is not going to happen. And that is something that India feels that you know, in, in this position, um, there are multiple causes for this conflict and therefore political dialogue is, 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 is the only way forward. India's stand on Russia has, however, not strained ties with the United States, as some had feared. With an eye on China, both countries stepped up their strategic partnership this April. Today, we are positioning the U.S. and Indian militaries to operate and coordinate closely together across all domains and increasingly across the wider Indo-Pacific. Indian and U.S. armies held joint exercises close to India's border with China last month. The rise of, of China is, is, a, is one of the most powerful forces of our times certainly has consolidated this consensus uh, that India and, and America will have to work together. Having good relations with both the West and Russia, analysts say in the coming months, India hopes to play a constructive role in any efforts to end the armed hostilities in Ukraine. Anjana Pasricha for VOA News, New Delhi.